there's so many dragonflies in my backyard flying around every day. There's so many lizards. There's so many hummingbirds. So hi, if you're new to my channel, um, I talk about spirituality, parenthood, and astrology, and there's so much more I'll be talking about. So today I wanted to touch on grounding or earthing. Um, earthing is the physical version of grounding. Um, so what it is, is it, it's just what it sounds like. It's earthing, touching the earth being connected to the earth on a physical level. So stepping outside with your with your with your feet off. <laughs> stepping outside with your shoes and your socks off, feeling the wet soil or grass on your feet and in between your toes. It feels so good and it helps to ground you. Um, going to all of your plants and giving them love and attention, rubbing them, um, talking to them in a loving way. One of my favorite ways to earth is um, sitting in the grass and just meditating. It is amazing. <laughs> it feels so grounding, like just feeling that earth under you and knowing that Mother Earth is supporting you in every way that she possibly can is so rewarding and so like safe like it makes you feel safe and protected and loved connecting with the plants and the grass and all of the elements the wind the sun water if you have a pool um, or even if you just want to have fun and go outside and play with water like be childish have fun play with the water splash yourself with water pour it on your head for the longest time i avoided the sun and i don't even know why it wasn't even something i feel that i personally felt like I wanted to do. It was like other people I was close to didn't want to be in the sun. So I thought, you know what? I don't want to be in the sun either because I picked up on those energies. I'm like very um, influenced by energies and emotions. I'm just like a very sensitive being. Uh, all of us are, but I feel like I am very, I'm very prone to, to confusing other people's energies and emotions with my own. So I thought that that was something that I was feeling, but it actually wasn't. And as of late, I have been spending more time just soaking up the sun and the, the rays and the, the sun codes, the vitamin D. And I have noticed a shift in my state of being every day. When I come outside and I sit in the sun or I stand in the sun or I just do what I do in the sun, I feel uplifted, I feel happy, I feel love, I feel so many good things. <laughs> Changing your attitude about like certain weather conditions can make you appreciate the natural weather so much more. Like I, I had this like 
mindset of like, oh, I hate wind. Like it makes my eyes dry. It makes my hair blow in my face. Um, dirt blows in my eyes. And as soon as I like changed that like mindset and like appreciated like the breeze and like it looked at it as like something like calming and like a way for Mother Earth and like the the elements to communicate with us, um, I appreciated it like so much more. The wind, the heat from the sun, the coolness of the wet grass on my feet. Um, I like to do that in the morning because it it wakes me up like putting my my warm feet where I was just like cozy in bed to earthing and putting my warm feet onto cold grass in the morning wakes me up but in like the sweetest way <laughs> and also just being still in the environment you notice so much more and not only do you notice so much more but i feel like you attract so much more when you're appreciating what's around you like i find i as soon as i started like appreciating all of this like all that nature brings i started to have more um animals come into my realm of being like i there's so many dragonflies in my backyard flying around every day. There's so many lizards. There's so many hummingbirds. Um, when I go for walks, I constantly see bunnies. And a lot of the time they don't run away, they just stay there because I try to like come off with like a really calming energy so that I don't scare them. And like, I try to like emit like loving like energy so that it's like, they're not afraid of me because <laughs> I don't want them to be I want them to to interact with me um, but I started attracting like so many so much more animals when I started to appreciate like just the simple magical beauty that nature is so that's pretty much um, all I wanted to talk about I just wanted to kind of remind you of the free if this is free like earth it's free and I think that we should take advantage of that and we should connect with it because when we connect with it we connect more with ourselves because we come from earth earthlings we are earthlings and so when we connect with our home in such a, a deep way in such a physical way it can be so it really can just emit the feelings of like happiness and joy. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Um, I will probably be posting another video soon. I mean, I will be posting another video soon. I just know, don't know exactly when. Um, but yeah, so thanks. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And then if you want to be notified whenever I upload a new video, um, just hit the notification bell and select to get all notifications um and yeah